Okay, kids. We gotta find Clandon, and we gotta find Troik. Well, I doubt Clandon will tell us anything, but there's gotta be something going on with him. Howdy. Hello, my friend. Who are you? I didn't do anything. Leave me alone. So, what do you do here? I don't see how that's your business. I'm just a guest here, having a little fun. If you're to fight your skittish as a rat with a fucking mousetrap up its ass, I'm gonna guess your troik. Kachino sent me to ask you about some guns. Kachino? Kachino what? Are you kidding me? He must be trying to get me killed. Look, I'm looking to help Kachino break up whatever the bosses are planning. Yeah? Well, fuck that. The bosses have my number and I'm a company man while they got the goods on me. Look, maybe I can help you out for your contract. More power to you if you can, but keep me out of it. I've been doing business with Big Saw, so he's going to be your man. You again. Make it quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just tell me what happened with you and the hooker. Oh, man. I don't even like to think about it. All that goddamn blood. It was just in the hotel like any other night. I took some chems with the girl I was with, but I never black out. I did this time, though. Next thing I knew, I woke up, she was lying next to me, stabbed dead. There was a knife next to the bed, and I was covered in her blood. Well, do you know where the knife came from? I keep a little switchblade tucked away with me. You never know when you might find some trouble. Yeah. I have a couple more questions of what happened that night. Alright, have at it. What kind of chems were you doing? That night, mostly buff out. I like to cut it with a little bit of jet and wash it down with some whiskey. That was my standard Saturday night. Look, that doesn't look, sound like it was anywhere near enough to make you black out. What? Yeah, you're right. I wonder what was up with that. Well, more questions. Alright, have at it. How did the family find out about it? When I it? saw the body, I started screaming. In a few seconds, some of their soldiers were in there cleaning up the room. They offered to keep silent about what happened if I agreed to help them get their hands on large quantities of guns, at deep discounts. Continuing on. Right. That's it for now. Something doesn't add up there. It's a bit too convenient that as soon as he barked out, they had men in the room clearing up the body. Oh, don't you worry about me, dearie. Your grandma knows how to stay quiet. Let's, uh... Borrow something off him. Bingo. What weapons do I have left that I didn't take off me? Lucky, you ain't got no ammo. Pew pew, got no ammo. Four rounds of 45 auto. Ah. We've got four clips of anti personnel. Ooh Mr. Weapons Shipment, I'm Max. Nice to meet you. Flamethrowers, sniper rifles. They got the works here. I'll grab one of these rifles. Could be somewhat useful if things get a bit hairy. Not sure about the flamer though. Can't see myself carting that around for long. Or entirely unnoticed. Okay. They say those robots on the strip are running around with different faces or something. Don't ask, because I don't know. Oh, trust me, I know. And I'm starting to regret my decision. Hello, friend. Don't you worry about me. Okay. So Big Sal knows what's going on. 
He must have an office or something somewhere on this place. I doubt a man will ask us if we ask him. Well, tell us if we ask him. Send us to his sweets. All right, here we go. Things are bad for business. NCR should do the fucking job. And even lower. Shit, this wasn't all I wanted. Bingo. Major blood stains. Close a damn door. Huh. Whiskey. Atomic cocktail. Let's check the upstairs before we go down. Well, I don't think this is Big Sal's room, but. Somebody had an awfully good time downstairs. Oh. They say those robots on the strip are running around with different faces or something. Hey, nice to meet you. Do you need help with something? So, uh, what do you do around here? A little bit of this and a little bit of that. How did you end up on a hotel I'm suite? a close friend of some of the family around here. I do some independent contracting around the casino and they set me up with this great room. Oh, that's sweet. Kachino sent me to talk Kachino. with you. Kachino? Yeah, I've heard the name. Not sure why he'd send you to me. Is he helping out with room service or something? Ah, uh, never mind. Yeah, he is kind of creepily nice. Don't mind us, buddy. We'll just, um... Okay, so this is his room. Got blood coming out of Jesus. That's a lot of blood. Grilled mantis. Huh. More from here in the bathroom. Well, whoever it was must have bled out, because I can't find anything. Camera and a hockey mask. No way, two odd items. Yep, don't mind us, buddy. You just keep on walking around doing what you're doing. Thank you. Maybe the NCR and teams have been getting along. That's good news for me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's great news. Really great news. What's down here? I'll just wait a bit. Bottle caps. And what is this? Oh, Jesus. Jesus H. Christ. Mr. Clandon? I think we have a way of fucking you over. Where is a little snake? Uh, 
Clandon. Crap, he must be in here somewhere. Bosses don't like no trouble in their place. Ain't causing no trouble. Come on, come on, come on. Fuck. Boom. Time for medicine. Come on, get on through. Oh, Edie, that's your shadow. I thought that was a bloodstain. Okay, what do we have in this room? Nothing. More nothing. And shit, who's that? Oh crap, it's Clandon again. Why is he sleeping over here? Is it because we were fucking about in his room earlier? He's staying in Kachino's room. <laughs> we'll just take your journal back, Kachino. The NCR and the Kings of the Hey, Day. kid. Good to see you again. Hope you're winning some money in here. Oh, yeah. I'd, uh. I think the authorities would like to hear these tapes I found in your safe. I think I should kill you before you have a chance to show those tapes to anyone. What do I have to lose? You can't have a tape spell, keep them myself if you leave and never come back. Fuck, I was getting tired of this place anyways. I can find girls to play with somewhere else. Christ, I should have just killed you. In fact... Oh, Clandon! Got a present for you. Holy shit! <laughs> uh, that was amusing. Let's get the fuck out of here before anybody notices. Go, 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 go. Find yourself a girl or a guy. Have some fun. Oh, yeah, I will. Don't worry. Ugh. Fucking hell, I'm good. Alright. Turn the place over. Anything. Anything. Nope. Come on, one of these has to be Big Sal's room. Shit. A fat man mine. We will take that. That guy's obviously asleep at his post.
Hi. Um. Off we go. And let's try that again. Jesus Christ. The guards here leave a lot to be desired. Okay, some of these have to be... Mentats, no. Useless. Take these bottle caps, though. Who is this? Nero. Alright, it's not Big Sal, but Nero was a name that we heard. Bingo. Thanks, fucker. Easy peasy, now we just wait until daytime. Hopefully he will have shifted out of his room. Nice. Mute fruit. More mute fruit, meeting people. Hmm. At least the sink water's rad free. We just need to get up and shit, he's still here. Hi. Hey. Get the fuck out of my room. Doing so right now. We'll just blame Kachino. Okay, little map, what are you pointing towards? Alright, so if we go this way... And then... God damn it. Alright, fuck it. Back down to the sweets we go, maybe. Or I haven't really been in here, I don't think. One of these has to be an office. For fuck's sake, where would you keep your office? Hot damn, do I love this place. Yeah, yeah, I bet you do. Some more fur. Oh, it's that prick. There is a lot of blood down here. Lower brimstone. In that case, we'll just go to the main floor. Ah, this place is built like a maze.
A maze made of drugs and hookers. Hmm, crabby. Take. That's not the way. Okay, they lead up. That's brimstone. Normal floor. I've heard that elite units are on the way to support our armies here. Aha! Uh -huh. This gets us upstairs. This is the type of place I would leave an office. Let's see, filing cabinets. Uh, nothing of any worth. Bingo. Oh, a copy of Guns and Bullets. Ah, it won't teach me anything I know, don't know already. <laughs> ah, crap. What did I just pick up that I didn't notice? Let's put that back there. Okay, big cell. Well, he's left it locked, so he's not that stupid. Insistent. Resilient. Assistant. Boom, bingo. If you aren't big cell, keep your grubby fucking fingers to yourself. Disengage lock. Troika blackmail note, what do we have here? Hey boss, we took care of Troika just like you asked. The stupid bitch that tried to run away made the perfect patsy. We get the double benefit of her stinking body serving as warnings for the rest of the girls. Troika was so fucked up on that spite jet we could have stabbed him in the balls and he wouldn't have said Daisy. Gonna take a little vacation for a bit. Troika may, may have seen one of our faces while he was drifting in and out. We don't want him to get suspicious. Hope that scrawny little fuck does some good business for you. Thanks for the bonus, boss. I hear you chase that chicken shit Benny shit. off. Good riddance. Right, what do we have this side? Oh, there's Big Sal, the man himself. That does not deal with him. Yep. Well, he's observing his duty. You again. I found proof. Well, that motherfucker. What the hell? Damn. Thanks for finding this. This would be plenty of proof to cover my ass if they try to rat me out to any authorities. Okay, so what you can, can you tell me about these guns? They're keeping them in a little utility section down off the basement. I don't Already know what know they're arming themselves for, but I know it isn't for the good of mankind. How do you get the guns into the strip? I'm pretty proud of myself. It's a stroke of genius if I could be so modest. The whole arrangement starts with an old buddy of mine in the Republic. He's responsible for packing and shipping supplies to the NCR on the strip. He marks some containers as food and medical and packs them with guns and other shit. From there, it took just a couple of greased palms to get someone to let me cherry pick a container or two out of every shipment. Easy as pie. Okay, I have more questions about these guns. Okay, try and be fast about it. What can we do to take care of them? As a little pet project, I've been making some thermite. 
thermite burns as hot as the devil's asshole and can melt through just about anything. I've been keeping it so if the family betrays me, I can hopefully do some damage before I end up dead or in jail. Okay, what's thermite? Thermite is a mix of rust and aluminum dust. If you add a little heat, a massive amount of heat is spit out. It gives off enough heat to melt through just about anything. It should make short work of the weapons. Okay, give me that thermite. Okay, here's the thermite and a key to the room where the guns are stored. Place the thermite on the crates in the room. I rigged the light switch outside the room to kick off a spark big enough to hold the thermite. That should turn that shit into molten slag. As soon as we're done talking, I'm gonna make myself like a ghost. I don't want to be anywhere near here when the bosses find out. Okay, let's talk about something right. else. You know what? Never mind. Alright, we need to talk to our rat Cacino first. Be sure to check out the courtyard. Some of the hottest asses in New Vegas shaking out there. Hoi! Sup, motherfuckers? Anybody seen Cacino? I would like to have a word with him. Hey, what can I do for you? I have some questions about the boss's plans. All right, let's have Clandon's been handled. Oh, is that so? Well, I can't say that I'm sad to see that fucker gone. What's the next step? Now we cut off the head of the serpent. Big Saul and Nero have to die. How do they need to die? As long as they're alive, they can start up their plans again. All you've managed to do is stall them. I guarantee you they have contingencies. So how do we take care of them? They're a little bit upset about what's been done to muck up their plans. They task me to find out who's responsible. There isn't gonna be another chance to get both of them together in the same room. I'll slip you a gun, and we can take them out. Okay, what happens when the bosses when are gone? When they're gone, I'm gonna run this joint. Don't worry, I'll take care of this place. Alright. I'm not ready for that yet. Hurry and get ready. I'll give you a gun when you get to the room. Alright, let's blow some shit up and kill some mobsters.